What's up, everybody? My name is Cheese Bannerman, and welcome back to Deadly Premonition, the director's cut. In the last episode, we finally got the documents, but I had to head back to Mr. Stewart's, uh, I guess, mansion. But I ended up going in circles trying to get, figure out where I've got to go, and I still don't know where I've got to go. Because that's locked, that's locked, that's locked. I mean, maybe some of these might have, like, locks to shoot off. I mean, that is a possibility. I mean, it's the only thing that seems of the logical explanation. Right? I mean, I, I don't know. Oh, hang on. Was he here? Uh, I don't know. Oh! Whoa! Me! For some reason, I don't have my weapon equipped. I thought, I thought someone might monitor, oh, it's the game. No, it is the game, because the minute ago, the, the, court, the, uh, the, um, the color balance looked very dull and then went back to being bright. Um, uh, why not? Let's fucking use the shotgun. That's shooty, shooty, shooty. Oh, right in the ankles. Is there something important here? Ooh, ammo. More ammo. I should really figure out at some point going to that gunsmith shop guy and buying some uh, guns at some point. I keep forgetting to do stuff like that. There we go, that's a reload button. Also, this is a new recording session for me. Because I mentioned in the last episode I was going to have dinner and we'll probably do another recording, but afterwards I just wasn't <laughs> feeling up to it. Okay. That's where he went, wasn't it? Because the glass smashed. I assumed that was where to go. There's nothing here but a flat door. Right, let's look at the map again. Okay, yeah, there's a locked door here. So let's go to that door and see if it has like a padlock. No, it's that. Where am I going? In circles, for sure, certain. Because. Again... No, wait, have I been here? Oh, that's, yes, it's back this way, so... Hmm. Not that way. Can't go that way, it's a dead end. That's a dead end. That's where I just came from. That's a dead end. These, are these statues have something to do with it? No, I can't interact with them. Oh, I'm really and truly stumped. I'm as stumped as Patrick Stump. Uh, I can't go through there. I mean, where in the devil am I supposed to be going? Oh! I guess that would be an answer, right? Unless it's locked. Oh, I don't think we have to do more. I don't know the puzzle. Oh, wait, these are all out of places. I don't think. Yeah, I think goody. What were you? The barrel, I guess. Uh oh. <laughs> So it doesn't have to do some fighting. Oh yeah, I oh, forgot I've got the red suit on. Hello, boys and girls. I guess the power is to blow them to smithereens. Smithers. We got a gun and then we're going to shoot them. Oh, someone's coming a little too fasty. Oh, I got two in one. How about that? Oh, he didn't die. Look tough. Are these, are these explodies? Whoa! <laughs> They are exploding. Did I get someone in the process? No, I did not. But I'm gonna get you in the butt. Whoa! Oh, excuse me. Boundaries? She's got a bat! I should probably reload now. What was the reload destiny? Oh, oh, oh. Skitty, oh, she ain't dead. Now she is. Oh, I don't care if you score. You go boomy now. Explosies. Good for you, you swore. I'm gonna shoot him in the Ooh. That was a pitiful Oh Oh that's not good. I'm not doing good. I need to I need to start healing right this instant. This big one? Yush. There we go. Shoot him in the deck. Uh, 
I'm shooting again. So I think I should probably use something else. Shotguns are great, but they are very much on my half ammo. No, I'm not. It's intense music is supposed to make it dramatic and tough, but it really isn't. Shooting in the back. Booyah, easy peasy, lemon squeezy. Alright. What we got here? Ooh, some shotgun at. Uh, uh, Shotgun ammo. My brain went dead on me again. I wonder if my brain will ever pop working. It probably won't. Right. I'm guessing down here, yeah. Would be the smart thing. As long as we don't have to deal with um, uh, the wall ones. I am. Hang on. What? Let's look at my map again. What's in the other wall next to me? Oh! Um, wait, hang on. Wait, what is that? I was going to shoot that down and go through there, but I might as well do it. Let's do it now. Shoot. Let's do a shooty shooty to the lock. And get a clear shot that is. Oh, yeah. I actually want to see what this room is before we move on forwards. Because it might have items. You never know. Ah, it's medals. That's something. I'll take them. What's in the drawers? Uh oh. Hello? Ma'am, excuse me. Should never walk in someone trying to ch change clothes. It's very rude. She's got the dancing feet. Me! Guess what? Me! Great, try to get nice and close and. Boosh! Oh, shit! Kind of scared me a little bit. Okay, what was this? What was it? You want, didn't want. To, oh, you didn't want to take the first aid. Oh, tough shit. Because I am taking the first aid because I might need it. I'm gonna load up this Charlie, and then we're gonna go down this hallway, I guess. Oh, hello, statue. Wait, am I going around in circles again? Oh fuck! I think I went around in circles again, didn't I? I'm just going round and round and round. In circles. It's like a fucking maze here. I, um, there's more locked doors, so I guess I just keep going to every locked door. Because I don't know where I've got to go. There's no mark or anything. Going there. Yeah, I guess that is the case. Unless I've got to get to the opposite side of some of these doors. I don't know. I have no idea where I'm going now. Um, let's go to that locked door then and see what we can make heads or tails of. Because I am seriously getting just a little annoyed. Because I am. Is this the door? Yeah, okay. I'm starting to get a little bit annoyed because I have no idea what I'm supposed to bloody well do right now. Because I keep going around in circles. Oh, is that the point? Uh, there was no locked door that way. Figure out where I've got to go. These statues don't do anything. I can't interact. Okay, no, that's another one of those. Because it's hard to tell which one's a locked door in the sense of like it's got a padlock on it, and what ones would just have vines on them. Because I am at a loss of what I'm supposed to do. I guess I'll be back in a second. Because I have no idea where I'm going or what I'm supposed to do. I mean, is that there? It's not like I can get to it. How do I get to it? Is the question. So I'll be back in a second once I, yeah. Uh, Figure out what the hell I'm supposed to be doing. Oh, hello, hello. We've got another red thing. Ah, uh, interesting. A bunch of statues. So I'm going to have to... I don't mind having to fight. You know, think about in this situation. I think uh, the better... Ooh, hang on. I was about to say the better weapon would be the... Um, the uh, thingy. I have an idea. Boy! Oh, Jesus, that got me too. Oh, no, you got me. You got me good, sir. Headshot! That's a different line. Whoa! 
me. Is that over? Don't really need a golf club. Oh, yeah. And you're dead. Now we're getting somewhere. Now it could be gas. Alright, reload again. Or not, let's just keep going. And hopefully I'm going the right way this time. Yeah, let's look at the map. This is always the best way. Unless I circled round again. Seems that way, doesn't it? Unless this is a point to this, that I have got to go through every door. Let's see. Now, this leads me. This will lead me back that way, so there's no point of going that way. So maybe go the other way? But then that'll lead me there. Hmm. I thought I was making some progress, but clearly not. I guess I'll be back again. I thought that meant something, but I guess not. Oh! Something's happening. Huh? Let's, um. Uh... Emily! At times we must purge things from this world because they should not exist. Even if it means losing someone that you love. Stop! Sorry, this is the way he did it. I was like, STOP! <laughs> Give me your hand so we can dance! Zack, did you see that? Yep. I must be getting tired. Okay, that must be important then. Guess we actually are getting somewhere. I thought I had a lock in it. Oh, hang on, this looks different. Ah, hello, you know. I was probably just going. Oh, a button. Should I push the button? Oh, there's more buttons to push. Grab that while we're here. And let's push the button. Turn on. Oh, come on, York. You gotta go. Psh, like that was a big. Oh, shit, it's time. It's time, it's time. Shit, 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 shit. Got it. I thought I got it in time. Just go. Bruh. Who's that? Ah, good old secret passage. Gotta love it. Down a dark and creepy corridor. Oh, down into the basement. That's always a lovely place to go. Oh, we got another kitchen. So, uh -oh. oh. I did not like that. Locked from behind. Oh, it's a library. An underground library. Oh, this is Mr. Stewart. Hello, Mr. Stewart. How are you doing, good sir? Have you been monitoring stuff? Are you the one behind all this weird, wacky stuff? Where's your uh, assistant? The one who likes to rhyme a lot. Is he dead? It's like a bat cave, actually. Zack. Looks like we're out of the countryside and back in civilization. What? This is civilization to you? Oh, there you go, bulletproof gas. Is it the boss fight? Welcome, your Welcome. Oh, I was giving him the document. I brought the documents. Just what is going on in here? I warned you about haste. Take it slow. You'll lose sight of what's important if you just rush past it. As an agent of the FBI, I'm sure you know. So many people have got it all wrong. They think speed is the key. Uh -huh. That being first is the best. They want speed and are satisfied with what the speed brings. Even if it means that they miss so much on the way, they don't even see that. 
I see everything that they don't. From here, I see it all. Then, when the time comes, I make use of what I've seen. I can get whatever I want in this way. Anything at all. You're certainly talkative today, Harry. But I didn't come here for a business lecture. Tell me everything you know. No! Speed is not important. Timing is what is important. Timing. York, you have a natural gift for waiting for the correct timing. Just be careful that your haste does not ruin everything. That will be vital to solving the current case at hand. York? I know more than you think, but less than what you hope. One, you have Nick in custody. Two, Thomas is missing. Three, Carol has a locket that belongs to the murderer. I also know that this case revolves around the Red Seeds. Mm -hmm. But that's about it. So you've got an inside line on police information. information really well. You hacked into the FBI network, too. Amazing. But I didn't come here to hear this. Then let us close the business seminar. It's time for a history lesson instead. Ooh, I love history. I remember it as though it were yesterday. Wait, he's a child, but that's clearly a fucking grown man. What's causing the weird they just hallucinations there? When I got outside again, the purple fog was spread. I covered my nose and mouth and ran home. I unconsciously counted the number of times the bell rang. After the twelfth time, the bell did not stop ringing. It rang a loud thirteenth time. to see 
The rain cut convinces his daddy. Wait, how does Ben Slash to gut pit you in a wheelchair? If it was his back, it'd make sense. The following morning, I awoke surrounded by dead bodies. It wasn't raining anymore, and the purple fog was gone. I couldn't believe what I saw and what I myself had done. But even worse things were waiting for me when I got home. My mother was dead. Killed, presumably, also by my father. Um, kind of gathered that. Unless he's... I, I zoned out for a second because I was too busy listening to him and didn't realize his assistant was there. Next day, the town was overrun by military personnel. That's when the gag order was issued. What you say is true, and the killer is someone who is badly affected when it rains. You need to draw the conclusions, not I. I have no conclusions. Is there a connection between the red seeds and the gas, then? This is just my own presumption. The seeds and the gas have a similar effect on our nervous system. I believe someone figured that out and decided to use it. Or it could just be nature's way of getting back at us humans. Oh. So, what happened in the past isn't true or was true? Okay. Let me ask you one thing then, Harry. You're a businessman. You must be after something in return for giving me this information. York, at times we must purge things from this world because they should not exist. Even if it means losing someone that you love. That still does not justify murder. Remember this. Everything changes in form. There isn't a single thing that can maintain its shape for eternity. Remove this fact. You are making a big, big mistake. Is there some weird plot twist that Mr. Stewart is actually his dad? The Thirteenth Veil. That's what the name of this chapter was then. Didn't realize. Okay, I think this is generally a good point to end it here now. So, in the next episode, we'll, well, we'll find out what happens next, I guess. Uh, I was just... So, purple gas? Let me try to work this out. So, the... So the whole weird zombie things he's seen is just purple gas or the just hallucinations? The old hallucinations uh thing? They're not real? Then it, does that mean that York's just shooting at nothing? Oh, whatever. I'll probably figure find out more later. But that said, I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you're a wonderful day.
Thanks for guys and gals. In the next one.